is so great to see you. Congratulations on your new little baby girl. Thank you. Oh my God. She's, I don't know how I made her. She's so pretty. She, she, I, oh, look at that. I mean, come on, that happy little <laughs> smile. You, so, so the name, I, I looked at it and I just saw a lot of letters and it's a lot of consonants. Yeah. Um, how do you pronounce it? It's La'akea Makalapu Okalani Po Brown. I know, she's a Hawaiian, my husband's Hawaiian. He's got a Hawaiian name, so do my kids, so my other boys, so I couldn't name her Stacy May to kind of stand out. Okay, so what is your son's name? Um, we have Kaleo, oh my God, this is a quiz. Uh, Kaleo. But that's a short name. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, the middle, they have two middle names. Okay, it's Kiave <laughs> Pu'akele Aloha, I think, is uh, wait, Keave's. Wait, yeah. what, you think your son's name is? Yes, Keave Pu'akele Aloha, and then it's Kaleo uh, Lealoha Okalani, and Travis's middle name is Ku'u Ali'i Aloha, which I had to practice when we got married, yeah. So I really practiced my, my little girl's name a lot, but it took a couple tries. So everybody, in, is, aren't there short Hawaiian names anywhere? There's no Chad or anything? I mean, there's lots of options to shorten it. You know, there's a lot of nickname options. Like what in will there. her name be shortened? Well, we just call her Poe. Poe? Yeah. Okay. That, <laughs> that's it. That's good. Yeah. Because I, I, that's crazy that, to, and the last name is what? Brown. <laughs> <laughs> not fair. Well, I was, I was having a discussion with my husband. I'm like, oh, you know, it's, it's a lot for me. And he's like, well, we can, this is what her name will be. Well, you can call her whatever you want. And I'm like, well, right. okay. So Poe Brown, that's, that's what I call her. Um, so you went back to, to wrestling, to WWE, like what, three, four months after? Four months. Four months after yeah. delivering. Mm -hmm. um, why? <laughs> uh, well, my, my mom, uh, she was an example of being a working, strong mother. She uh, was working as an engineer and working for a PhD and was the first American to win the world championships in judo while she was a single mother all at the same time. And I always felt like I could do anything as a mom because of her and I wanted to give my little girl that same example. Oh, and my mom. Uh, made weight and won the U.S. Open six weeks after giving birth to my sister Maria. Wow! Yeah. So I was like, I kind of, I don't think I could beat that record, but you know, I can't just let it lie. I gotta do something cool. So um, as soon as I knew my due date, I was like, you know what? I bet I could come back and win the World Rumble and go to WrestleMania within that time frame. So that I set that goal right away, and uh, it seemed insane at first, especially right after giving birth, because I felt like I just got like hit by like a semi truck carrying razor blades straight in the crotch. And I was like, I don't know how this is gonna make this work. But um, you know, I tried real hard and worked really hard and got there. And how, uh, when did you like at what point? So you deliver um, Poe and, and then how, how long after that did you start like working out? Um, God, well I started like my diet two weeks after, and then um, I think six weeks, they're like, don't do anything or else you could hurt yourself. Right. Which I'm like, I know my mom didn't do that, but you know, I, I waited till six weeks to start working out, yeah. Wow, so you start, you start training, getting ready to, to do this, and uh, you posted a picture of you breastfeeding. So you're training, you're working out, posted a picture of you breastfeeding, got lots of attention, but I think it's a powerful thing, and you, you posted it for this kind of the reason you were just saying, right? Is that you can be, you know, working, independent, busy, raising a child. Yeah, that was actually right after I, I won the Royal Rumble, and I got back into our little bus, and she was hungry, and I just ripped off my wrestling gear and went down to feed her first thing. And I'm like, first I felt bad. I'm like, I'm probably a little salty. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, you know, it's it's... I wanted to give that example. My mom breastfed, you know, my sisters and myself, and my little sister is 11 years younger than me, so I remember my mom, like, doing stuff and working and being anywhere and just, you know, she just whip it out and feed her at any time, and it, it always felt normal to me. And uh, my boys asked me, we were gonna go to Hawaii for a trip, and they said, Where are you, how are you gonna feed Poe when you're, when you're flying? I'm like, well, the same way I always do. But they'd never seen anyone breastfeed before, so they didn't know that it was, like, a normal thing and acceptable to do in public, and yeah. so, I just kind of wanted to put it out there, but like, hey, you know, this is normal, this is natural. I can work, I can kick butt, and I can feed my little baby girl at the same time.
a badass. <laughs> I'm trying to be. You're you badass. are. Um, and so now you're hosting uh, WrestleMania for the second time this weekend, right? Uh, yeah, I'm going to be in the main event for the second time. This yep. was the, I was the part of the first main event with women, right. and this is now the third. So it's becoming uh, almost something that doesn't even need to be mentioned anymore, which is the goal. Yeah, yeah, that's <laughs> that is the goal when it's not a big deal. I got you something. Uh, I think it's a the for, your, for your daughter. No, the butt is you want. You, this is for your daughter. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> this is a little cute. Oh so y'all can have little matching outfits. I love it. Oh, all right. We'll it. take a break. More with Rhonda after this.